The issue in our education is represented within these two pictures. Can you guess the problem? The issue is lack of cultural representation within school communities. In the state of Utah, over 75% of students are white. The next largest race in schools are Hispanics at 17%. The other 8% is shared among all other ethnicities that could be represented. It would make sense to support the minority when so few are encouraged to even pursue an education, right? Not to the school district. There are no supports for the majority of the minority. Midvale Middle School has somewhat of an exception. The school consists of a majority of Hispanics at 42%. Next up we have 40% whites and 16% other. Now although this school has a greater amount of minorities, they only choose to support Latinos. Their club, Latinos in Action, is the only one that supports the minority group exclusively. Other clubs aimed to support diverse ethnic backgrounds have all been slashed. Pacific Islander Club and Black Student Union are an example of this. In other words, Latinos are the only ones that can represent their culture around school. Others do not have this opportunity to show what makes them different and unique. This leads them to not feeling comfortable with their own cultural identity. Midvale Middle School is part of a middle years program. The MYP aims to develop active learners and internationally minded young people who can empathize with others and pursue lives of purpose and meaning. What better way to help our students empathize with others and have international mindsets than to teach them about the cultures of the world? This leads me to my solution to the problem. To restate the problem, schools do not represent the different cultures of the community. How do we fix this? We need to implement the same type of support for other students and clubs. In addition to this, we should introduce diversity assemblies in each school once a year. This gives students an opportunity to perform for their peers and teach them about the culture. We have done similar assemblies to this in the past. All we have to do is begin it once again. Video made and voiced over by McKenna Lullapolly.